Hey YouTube, this is Tiger24. Yesterday, my second Harambe came in, and I definitely knew I wanted this Karambe and I had to have it. You hear so many great things about Cold Steel um, products and the triad lock, you know, how unbreakable it is. Anything could be break, broken, but this is very good, you know. And what made me interested in this product was the overall build quality and just the look. Just the overall look. And the thing is, I love the G10. When I first got into knives, the first knife I really got was some cheap Walmart knife. Then I got a um, Spiderco Tenacious, which I love the G10 on it. But this G10, it's very grippy. And with this pocket clip, it came on the left side. I switched it to the right. It would tear up your pockets. And I learned that quick just from yesterday, you know. And the frame lock, I'm saying the frame lock, the triad lock, it's very, like what they say about it, it's very true. I don't see this failing at all. This has S35VN and it's nine inches. Just a full forward grip. Just look at this forward. That's a lot of reach. And that's what I really liked about this. I really like that about this. This is made very simple. It don't have nothing flashy. No the big designs and stuff, but it's made very sturdy with quality materials. And I love it. You know, the S35VN was good. For the price, especially. Like this didn't come with all the flash. You know, it just came with a basic bubble wrap, but this is a very good karambit, a very good karambit. And also this piece right here, you can wave it. You can wave it easily. And what I don't like is closing this. You really got to catch this at a right spot. I don't know if it's just me, but when you hit it from the top, it doesn't really lock. But if I catch it from the back right here, I can close it. And yeah, like when closing it, look, look at this. It snaps. And it did catch me yesterday. And I didn't even feel it at first. I just noticed my girlfriend was like, hey, you're bleeding your finger. Then I realized it caught me and it caught me at an angle where it went from the side. Yeah. But I definitely recommend this Tiger Claw, you know, reverse grip, it just feels nice, and this sticks out very far, very far, and with this little piece right here, you hear a lot of people talking about they can't wave it, or it's not perfect, and they'll compare it to the Emerson and the Fox. That Fox Karambit is good, but I would only get that probably in the um, frame lock. Actually, the back lock. But this joint right here is easily able to wave. And I'm going to show you right now. I'm going to wave it with it clipped in my pocket and loose. See, this is clipped in. And I don't understand what people's talking about how this fails and it just doesn't work. You know? And this is just clipped into my pocket easily. Look. Second time. Clipped in. Now, with it loose, just sitting in a pocket, it still wave. Look. Right? This works 100% of the time. It's Tiger 24. And I do approve the Tiger Claw. You know? It's simple. Made with good materials. And you get what you pay for. And this blade, this blade is big. Like, very big. Compared to my other Karambit. Yeah, this is a lot bigger. And... I would recommend this to like any guy or anybody who's looking for a Karambit and I love it.